This 100-year-old loom weaves Scotland's most traditional of textiles, but the founder of this mill has a very modern mindset. Claire Campbell opened her company Prickly Thistle at this Eventon site four years ago. She wants to encourage people to adopt more natural fibres in their clothes, helping both the planet and their purse. Textiles now, 60% plus of all fabrics used in clothing are made of polyester. That's oil, that's the highly flammable label. Um, and what's really damaging about polyester is not just how it's used to create the garments, but throughout the lifetime of that garment. So 25% of all carbon that comes from clothing is through the machine washing that we're doing. So we're washing these clothes you know, every minute around the world. Every second there is a machine full of polyester. So there is energy consumption there, but there's microplastics that come from all of this plastic clothes. Claire's taking her message to Manhattan as part of New York Tartan Week. With many American clients on her books, she hopes to highlight the benefits of more eco-conscious clothing. Wool is incredible. It will keep you warm, it will keep you cool. So energy you know, costs are rising, but actually wearing more wool in your home, you will actually be naturally regulated. You will be warmer. So not only is it kind of yeah, dealing you know, with this, this crisis that we're seeing in terms of energy consumption, but we have got so used to wandering around with its, you know, very, very cold outside, wearing shorts and t-shirt and having the heating on. But by wearing clothing that naturally regulates your body temperature, that doesn't need the same washing, you are going to actually save on the energy. Um, so there's a financial saving there, but it's the planet that saves. And this has got to be the kind of, this is the long game. I want to be able to go out there and say that we've, there is a Scottish company, a Scottish mill, who champions probably the untold story of this fabric. Um, it's not, you know, that kind of, a say, two, three hundred year story, which is amazing, but I think, you know, in 200 years, I think we need to be talking about something else and how this fabric actually reminded people of the past because the past worked. With bold and bright colours, Claire hopes her designs will help persuade people to think more about what they wear, putting Scotland at the forefront of a textile revolution. Nicola McCallie, TV News.